Hello everyone, welcome to this Cosen Mathematics 2016 Part 2. And you can see there we have the integration, the matrices equation uh, problems. So number two, start with let A be known equals to A of matrices of 1 minus 1, 1, 1, with A is uh, greater than 0. And there's some identity matrix, 1, 0, 0, 1. And satisfy that a to the power of 4 plus i, identity matrix, is 0 matrix. Everything in the element is 0. And we have to find a. So basically, we just have to uh, calculate what is a to the power of 4 first. So, so f to the power, a to the power of 4 plus i, is basically just this one. Uh, power by 4, which is multiplied 4 times. So, a of 1 minus 1, 1, 1, multi uh, power by 4, it is just a to the power of 4, but this matrices must be multiplied 4 times. So, 1 minus 1, 1, 1, is 1 times 1, 1 minus 1, 0, 1 minus 1, minus 1, minus 1, minus 2, and 1, this is 2, and this is 0. This is a squared, right? This is a, this is a squared. And now we multiply it again. 1 minus 1, 1, 1. This will become 0. This is minus 2. Multiply this, it will become minus 2. This will become 2. And this will become minus 2. And this is a to the power of 3. And now finally we multiply it again with 1 minus 1, 1, 1. Which is minus 2, minus 2, minus 4, min, uh, 2 minus 2 is 0, 2 minus 2 is 0, and minus 2 minus 2 is minus 4. This is a to the power of 4. And, you can, and we can substitute this value here, so minus 4, 0, 0, minus 4. And remember that this is also half a, so this is a to the power of 4, plus the identity, identity matrix becomes 0 matrix. And you can see here that we just multiply the constant in the matrix will just able to uh, multiply directly and we add it and we can see here minus 4 a to the power of 4 plus 1 equals 0 that is the only thing that we can do to find the a so a to the power of 4 equals 1 over 4 and a is plus or minus 1 over 2 and by the question that a is greater than 0 so the value of a is 1 over 2 so that is the answer for number 1 now for number 2 find the minimum of the positive integer such that a to the power of n multiplied by the matrix of 0 and 1 equals to matrix 1 0 and what is n what is the minimum positive integer n so basically here we just have to find the value of it one by one. So you can see if we put n equals 1, that will be a times 0 and 1, right? And a is actually 1 over root 2 times 1 minus 1, 1, 1 times 0, 1. This will result into uh, processing, we multiply it directly. Times 0, 1, this is will become minus 1 root 2, 1 over root 2. This is not equal to the, you know, the, the value of matrix 1, 0. If n equals 2, you can see that, that it will become a squared times 0, 1. We have multiplied a squared here, which is 0 minus 2 to 0. And if we just, you know, jot it down, it's 2 to 0. Uh, of 0, 1, and also remember there's a half here because you know the a is with there is a constant a, so anytime we multiply, we just have to make it squared if this is a squared, and then maybe to the power of 3, this is become a to the power of 3. So this here will result into 0, minus 1, 1, 0, 0, 1. This will result into minus 1 and 0. It is not the real 
not the result. And now, if n is 3, we can see that a to the power of 3, we have find the result is minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 minus 2. And then, this value, we multiply it by 3, is essentially 1 over 2 root 2 times minus 2 minus 2, 2 minus 2 of 0, 1. Again, this is have the value of 1 over root 2, right? So the answer must be having the element of root 2, which is not the answer of this. So we just go to n of 4. Now, a to the power of 4, we got the result of... Uh, minus 4, 0, minus 4. So that is... And also the a is to the power of 4, so that is uh, half root 2, we multiply it by 4. And the value of minus 4, 0, minus 4, times 0 and 1. And this will become 4. So that is 1 over 4. So that is minus 1, 0, 0, minus 1 of 0, 1. So that this will become 0 and minus 1, which is not the question, right? Now let's go to another, this a to the power of 5, when n is 5. And we have got the value that uh, a4 right a4 times a basically and you can see that when n is odd you can see that it has the value of the element of 1 over root 2 so we could actually skip that and let's directly go to n equals 6 and for n equals 6 you just continue the pattern of the multiplication and finally later you will get the result of 1 over root 2 matrix of minus 1 1 minus 1 minus 1 times over 1 over root 2, uh, 1 minus 1, 1, 1, it will become half of matrix 0, 2, minus 2, 0, and will become 0, 1, minus 1, 0. And when you later multiply it by 0, 1, it will result into matrix of 1, 0. Okay, so that is the answer for number 2, that when n equals 6, such that a to the power of n times matrix 0, 1 equals 1, 0. And now for... Number three, find the matrix of A to the power of 2014. So basically, we just have to find the pattern because we couldn't just uh, multiply that until 2014 times. So from the start, we have A is root 1 over root 2, 1 minus 1, 1, 1. And we got A squared is that we just have to multiply it uh, two times, right? For example, that we multiply it two times here. That is 1 over 2, and this is 1 minus 1, 0, minus 1 minus 1 minus 2, 1 plus 1 is 2, and minus 1 plus 1 is 0, so that is 0 uh, minus 1, 1, 0, okay? And for a to the power of 3, it has the element of 1 over root 2, and this is not the value, uh, the 2014 is the even number. And for 1 equals, and 1, 3, 5 is actually an odd number. So from here, we just skip the value of the odd number. We just go into a to the power of 4. Okay, so from a to the power of 4 is basically just uh, a squared times a squared, right? So this is just 0 minus 1. We multiply that. So it is 0 minus 1. This is 0. This is 0, and this is minus 1. And now, a to the power of 6, just a4 times a to the power of 2, minus 1, 0, minus 1, times 0, minus 1, 1, 0. So that is, will become uh, 0, and then 1, and then minus 1, and 0. So you can see here, uh, from a to the power of 2, 
there is still no pattern. You just have to still find the pattern. Let's go to the power a to the power of a, a to the power of six times a to the power of two. It also become zero plus zero one. So zero one minus one zero times uh, a two, which is zero minus one one zero. That will become one zero zero one. Right, the identity matrix. So if you want to find a to the power of 10, so a, a times a to the power of 2, so 1, 0, 0, 1, 0 minus 1, 0. And you can know that any matrix that multiplied by the identity matrix will go will goes into 0 minus 1, 1, 0. So now we have find the pattern is that for a2, a4, a6, a8 now back to A10, which is has the same pattern. So from 0 minus 1, 1, 0, and A4 is minus 1, 0, 0, minus 1, A6 is 0, 1, minus 1, 0, and A8 is 1, 0, 0, 1, right? And you can see that A10 follows the pattern of 0, minus 1, 1, 0, and from A12, 14, 16, until 2014, we had just have to find the the pattern of the line, which line that follows 2014. And you can see that this is this is A10 and A12, A14, A16. It will follow 18, 20, 22, 24. You just have to find the pattern of 2014. The best way to do it is just to test it one by one. So from 2 to 10, 4 to 12, 6 to 14, 8 to 16, the difference is 8. Right? But the initial value is different. So we just have to use the simple arithmetic formula. That is 2014, the, tar the target of the question, equals the initial value here, 2 plus n minus 1, uh, 8. If the value of n is the whole number after we find the value of n, that will become the pattern here. So if we do this, n minus 8, 2020 equals 8n. You know that this is n will not become a whole number, right? Test another, 2014 equals 4 now, plus n minus 1, 8. That is 2010 equals 8n minus 8. 2018 equals 8n. And you try to divide this, it will not become the whole number. So now it's the third line. 2014 equals 6 plus n minus 1, 8. It will become 2008 equals 8 n minus 8. That is 2016 equals 8 n. So you can see here n is we become uh, 252. Because n is the whole number, therefore a 2014 okay, is in this line. Then the value of 8 to the power of 2014 is 0 minus 1, minus 1, 0. So that is the answer for number 3. And yeah, so that is for part 2. And stay tuned for part 3. <music>